How old were you when you did Smallville? Everything I'm going to say, I'm always off a little bit. My mom would be like, Ryan, that's not even true. Uh, so let's say, I think I was 16 the first time, the first season. 16? And then Are you sure you were that old? I think I was 15. I mean, also, I, I looked like... You looked young. You were like me, a late toddler. bloomer. Yes. So late that's bloomer. another thing that was probably throwing you too. <laughs> Man, I mean, I just remember, and I remember thinking, I'm not just saying this, but I, I think I told you, I don't know if you even remember, but I was, I remember it was just saying, you're really good. You're going to be, you're going to, you're going to work. I remember telling your mom, I was like, this kid's good. You were well behaved on set. I don't know if she beat you. Yes. I don't know what, <laughs> what happened, but, uh, it was just like, you know, when you watch those episodes, those were the be- the two great episodes that you were in. It was heartbreaking. Yeah. Right, Ryan? Yeah. Ryan's? Oh, no, I've seen it. Now. Yeah, yeah. Was, yeah. Yeah, because he's had to watch them because yeah. he does Talkville as well with Welling. And um, what do you what do you remember? Just like going back, like, what do you remember? I mean, 15, you're not that young. No. So you probably remember a bit. Hey there, folks. It's Michael Rosenbaum. And boy, have I got a huge announcement for you. This has been a long time coming, and it's finally here. I'm doing a live podcast. My podcast, Inside of You with Michael Rosenbaum, is going live. Yeah, for the first time ever on Wednesday, October 11th at the iconic Regent in Los Angeles. And guess what? I'm not going to be alone. Um, We're bringing a guest you might remember. He's been on the podcast. He's a friend of the show. The one, the only, Zachary Levi. We're going to catch up on life and mental health and We're going to have a really good time with all of you. I think you know that. We're going to make it a lot of fun. We're planning a QA, and a maybe some fun games, other exclusive stuff you're only going to get by seeing it live. We're even hosting a VIP meet and greet for a small number of people before the show begins. Grab your tickets, mark your calendars, and get ready for the night of laughs, insights, and unforgettable moments. Tickets are limited, so don't miss your chance to join us on October 11th at The Regent in Los Angeles. Get your tickets now at insideofyoulive.com. This is going to be an epic night, so if you're in the area, come out and I'll see you there. Uh, you worked a ton I, me- I, since. Remember, I, I remember, I mean, again, like I said, my memory is terrible. So, um, it's all those roids, but, man, with all yeah, your bulk. Yeah, right? <laughs> uh, it's drop, you know, living in Hollywood, drugs being dropped on your head. <laughs> yeah. um, but, uh, what I what I do remember is Smallville was the first like it changed my life in the sense of that was I had been acting when I was younger, um, just kind of something my parents made me do. And I enjoyed it, don't get me wrong. But it was definitely like not forced, but like if I made an obligation to something, mom was like, Well, no, you have to do this, Ryan. You have to go to this audition. You said you would. Um and I took to it. I have a bunch of siblings, they didn't like it as much. I kind of loved it and I loved being out of school. I loved Yeah acting as much as I did sports and Smallville was the first time that I saw adults doing it for a living like it clicked in my head I was like wait I remember you guys were, um, especially the second season you guys were going through like talking to each other about contract negotiations I remember <laughs> you thinking, remember like, that a little bit yeah and I remember thinking like wow it'd be so cool one day if I could do that um, but the first one for sure I was like wait you guys do this for a living like you don't do anything like you didn't this is what you do you know and you guys are like yeah <laughs> so yeah. that was the first time it clicked in my head and then that it, it's a good thing and a bad thing my mom probably wishes that never happened because that was when I made in my head I was like oh I'm gonna lie to my parents and tell them I'm applying for college and not apply to college and then I'm gonna do this for the rest of my life that's what you thought at that age right when you were on set that so, was somehow the, it clicked in dude that was the first for sure Smallville was like where I was like oh I I, I want to do this too well how do I my parents are gonna make me go to college how do I oh, I'll just lie to them and then you know did you did you like doing it? Did you like acting? I loved it. You I, loved I it. I loved I loved being on set. Like that part is still to this day is my favorite thing ever. You love um, you would love the pro- the process. I yes, of making the art itself. You know, as you get older, the audition part is you want to beat you your still head against audition walls. a lot? Yeah. Here and there, you know. I mean it's 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 the name of the game. Getting back to, you know, like right now I'm not currently working on anything, so it's getting back to the grind.